Oh, hey. So today's video is gonna be about taxes. Please don't click away. Uh, I usually file my taxes a lot sooner, but um, I'm not gonna lie. I've been struggling a little bit in the economic department lately, so um, I'm a little excited to see what we're gonna get back. Let's, let's do it. Let's file taxes again. Please don't click away. All right, here we go. Boy, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I wonder what I should buy. I should just take a nice vacation somewhere, somewhere warm, even though it's really warm here. Actually, I'll probably just uh, buy a bunch of fruit snacks. Food is love. Food is life. Wait, I owe money? Well, that's not good. All right, all right. I'll just uh, use what I have to pay them because the last thing you want to do is owe the government money. All right, let's see here. Just need about a uh, four grand. No big deal, right? All right, account balance. Let's see, account balance is, oh, well, fuck. It's okay, it's okay, no worries yet. I make YouTube videos. I'll just use my AdSense revenue. What do we got? Well, it was nice knowing you guys. I'm uh, just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. No! You know what? All my life, I've taken care of everybody else and never asked for help. That ends today. Somebody will help. Somebody with a big, large, massive bank account. <laughs> Let's ask Bill Gates. To Bill G at Microsoft. Dot com. Hey Bill, I owe the government money and it's making me sad. Can I have some money? Said, all right, perfect. Now we just wait. Three weeks later. It's been almost a month and Bill hasn't gotten back to me. I see black SUVs circling my apartment. There's men in tuxedos following me. I think it's just time to ask somebody else, but who? Oh, uh, let's see. Rich people. Mark Zuckerberg. That works. No, wait. I recognize that face. Somebody I know used that face. Somebody rich. Well, hello, Mr. PewDiePie. You know, Pewds and all honestly seems like a nice guy from what I can tell. I mean, sure, he's anti-Semitic. Sure, he's a little bit racist. But I mean, none of those things really make you a bad person. Yeah, I mean, I'm not Jewish, so surely he'll help me out. Was that too soon? I'm sorry. But yeah, let's go to his latest video and leave him a comment. Ugh, turn that shit off. What? Dear Mr. Felix Kjellberg, the government is after me. Please send one million dollars to this account. Thank you. Uh, oh wait, P.S. I'm happy to see you're being bold with your hair. It's cool. Yeah. Looks good. You know, he hasn't uploaded in like two days. I'm starting to wonder if he's probably not gonna see this. Let's try a different platform. Twitter, here we go. At PewDiePie. Also, I think my last message didn't really get the seriousness of the situation across, so we're just gonna amp it up just, just a little bit. Just a little bit. I know you are a very busy person, but my life is in shambles and I need your help. Please send one million dollars. Also, a dog is dying and the only way to save him is to get a rare surgery that costs lots of dollar signs. That's not actually true. I'm allergic to dogs. But he has a dog, so I feel like he'll be extra sympathetic to that. Two thousand years later. Well, this is it. You know, I kind of expected Bill to ignore me, but Pewds, how dare you? I support you. I watch your videos. I bought your inspirational book, even though some of these quotes are subpar, to say the least. Be nice to people. Maybe one day they'll be rich. Seriously, what the fuck is this? It's bullshit. You know what? I'm gonna tear this thing. I'm just gonna fucking tear. Wait, I can't buy another one. Never mind. But you know what? I am gonna hit you where it really hurts. Watch this. Unsubscribe, a bitch. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay, if you made it this far into my video, hopefully you know I'm just joking. I don't know. I got this video idea weeks and weeks ago, and I wanted to film it because I thought it'd be funny to 
poke fun at Mr. PewDiePie, who is a money-grubbing little bitch. But uh, honestly, I think the meaning behind it has changed since I originally came up with the idea, especially with what I've watched happen over the last couple weeks. I think that at a certain point in success, people will take away your humanity and forget or just completely ignore the fact that you're human with thoughts and feelings and problems just like everybody else. And then in turn, they'll just focus on your popularity or what you have in your bank account and just make that what you're all about. And even if you aren't somebody who has a bunch of eyes on you, I think people are more quick to judge a mistake that you made rather than praise you for the things that you've done right. But I don't know. That's just what I think. Money isn't everything. Popularity isn't everything. I didn't start a channel to become popular or rich or successful. Um, doing this full time would be like a crazy dream of mine. It would be wonderful. Do I think that'll actually happen? Probably not. And that's totally okay because we're a safe little happy family of 90 or so internet friends. Nobody can hurt us here. <laughs> I'm so weird. I'm sorry. But anyways, I'm gonna go build an underground shelter to hide from the IRS. Here's my awkward outro. Enjoy it. Subscribe if you become internet friends. And other than that, peace!